Before dogs started living with humans and came to be known as humans' best friends, they used to live among wolves. Wolves considered them of lower status and would have them do their works. Cold was always heavy on animals, and wolves were no exception. While scouting and hunting, wolves have seen humans light the fire and use it to warm themselves. Since they couldn't make fire, they decided to steal it from humans. As men slept inside their huts, some wolves tried to pick up the coals, but they would drop it every single time. They tried to pick up the burning sticks, but that would not burn for long and threatened to burn their fur. Defeated, wolves assigned the task to the dog. Dog knew it was almost impossible task, so he decided to fake the stealing of fire. He would just pretend but not really steal it. Before sending him, wolves threaten him that since they are trusting him for this great job, if he fails, his life would be unbearable. Seeing no other option, Doc unwillingly left for the task. He walked the forest and reached the edge of the Indian village. He saw white clouds coming out of top of the herds. He had heard wolves talking about this. The fire should be inside the herds. Holding his breath, he moved to the closest hut. The door was opened. He stood at the door without any clue and just looked inside. He saw the women and children preparing something in a pot. Beneath the pot, the fire burned red. The hunter was nowhere to be seen. The women and children saw him and shouted in fear. People feared the wolves and Dog looked close to them. Dog lowered his tail and laid down on his back. Listening to the shouts, the man came running and saw the dog lying on its back near the fire. Men felt pity for the dog as the poor creature wanted to get some warmth. The man believed in the wolf spirit that would roam the forest and helped him get the hunt. Few days ago, the man had a dream that he would get a gift from the spirit and that would look like a wolf. This has to be this creature. The man felt grateful and thanked the spirit. He approached the dog and gave him some food. He promised the dog that they would be brothers forever. From that day, he would take him on the hunt as his companion and his family had got a member to play with. This is the legends and the lore where the myths and legends come alive.